Annie here for Coopers TV and this is the Coopers Beer Garden. Oh, I think the inspiration from the garden probably really came from Coopers. What is it? Well, it's a beer garden and it sells beer and it sells Coopers beer. I suppose some of the values that the Coopers brand represents and we hope were reflected in the garden were around sustainability. Tell us, tell us, what have we got here? You've got some mint, I believe, and some basil, some basil as well. What a crop. I mean, I'd be proud to have that in my backyard. You'd be pretty happy if your home brew cropped up like that, wouldn't you? Absolutely. We used local manufacturers, we sourced a huge amount of materials locally, and we even used you know, the product itself. We used cartons of coopers um, to acquire or purchase elements of the garden. So the Hills Hoist, for instance, we were we paid a carton of beer for every Hills Hoist that someone would give us. It's always a carton of beer and it's always a carton of coopers. Fantastic. We were just talking as a kid. I spent a lot of time up in the Flinders, so it's a very familiar uh, area to me, Parachuna, and then coming here to the Coopers Beer Garden at Wome Adelaide is just fantastic. Loving it. See, I, I like this corrugated iron effect. Do you come to Wome Adelaide every year? Yeah, we do. Yeah, we have Look forward to it from one year to the next. What's the best thing that you think you've seen so far at any of the uh, festivals you've been to here? Oh, the Coopers Beer Tent, definitely. I just love it. So, um, fancy a garden like this in your own backyard? Love one. Absolutely love one. It's rustic, it's healthy. Yeah, I'd really love it. Puts a different twist on um, beer garden, it does. doesn't it? <laughs> Guys, whereabouts are you from? We're from the UK, from uh, just south of London myself. Mm -hmm. What has brought you to Warm Adelaide tonight and how did you hear about it? We heard about it through friends. Uh, we work at the university and, uh, and pretty much everybody in the lab is going. And uh, so we're here to, to join up with them and uh, have a good night. And more specifically, what has brought you right here to this awesome beer garden, the <laughs> Cooper's Beer Garden? Cooper's Beer. <laughs> Ask a silly question. But it was kind of a nice take on, you know, this is, this is an organic product, almost like it's a product that just grows on you. We were up um, in the Flinders Ranges just before we came down here, so I didn't quite make it to the Prairie Hotel, but well, yeah, close enough. <laughs> pretty much here now. Yeah. It was genuinely eclectic. We weren't really aiming at a style there, and it was pulled together much the way, you know, a house that maybe students have lived in for 25 years has been pulled together, and it just works. Right, so what I'm hearing here is you guys are more than willing to get your green thumbs out to exactly. make this crop go crazy. Yeah, exactly. We'll drink that for sure. This is our fifth wild Madeleine, and this is where we always come to eat. It's, it's never packed as well. There's always good food here, great atmosphere. Really enjoy it. You open the fridge and there's not, some, there's not, not a bottle of Coopers in there. Um, it's, you really need to be doing some shopping. How many beers did we drink in the garden? Well, I was there every night.